it's funny when people say there's a lot of scams out there, robocalls and shit like that. <clears throat> you know, people making deals, promising favors, like, you know, you could do this for me in return, I'll do this for you. And that never happens. It's all scam, it's all fraud, it's all bullshit. But what people slack to know is life itself is a scam. <clears throat> life itself is a fucking scam. Easy example. This is a gift. Yet you're paying for the gift. Scam right there. You're getting frauded. Frauded, if that's even a word. It's a word now. <laughs> you know, you go to church. Supposed to worship the Lord. You know, God. And yet, what do you do? Comes to a time where these sheeps come with the baskets. You know, you got to put the money in there. So it's like I say to myself, what are we really worshiping here? Are we worshiping God or are we just worshiping some rectangular green piece of paper? Because I pretty much see that's what we're worshiping. You know, we say this about God. We say this, that, you know, pray for God. God could help us. But really, all we're allowing helping us is a piece of paper. That's the God. This whole planet obeys God. Um, God, money money god so just goes to show you right there life is a scam in itself go over uh, you know behind the church or wherever there's these candles that you light up make a prayer you know make a prayer for ukraine or or whatever meanwhile you could pray to the cows come home that nothing gonna happen that bastard's gonna keep blowing them up so you're just spending money on some fictional bullshit. Now, I'm not saying God's not real. I'm not saying God is real. Whatever you guys believe in, it's all upon you. I'm not against anyone's religion. But I'm just saying, things that they try to get us into, it's all bullshit. It's all a scam. It's all corrupt. Oh, yo, if you put this, maybe that it ain't gonna help shit. They're just trying to make this off of you. They're still gonna get their brains blown off, sadly, unfortunately. Do I hope that happens? Of course not, but it's gonna happen. All you're doing is just spending your money for some fictional bullshit. That's the honest fucking truth. I'm just gonna say it as it is. That's the honest fucking truth. What I'm trying to basically say in this video is everything they say is lies. They're feeding lies into you. Oh, get, for example, let's say your, your sinks clogged, for example. Oh, put this certain whatever the hell in here, it unclogs it. We end up grabbing that shit. She didn't do a damn thing but it sure got them this they make everything they exaggerate everything just for this whether the product's really good or whether the product's complete horse shit they'll make it ex you know they'll, they'll say some good shit about it just for this one fucking reason what's truly sad is how many blind people we have in this world when you're that dumb to not see or not see anything wrong with knowing that a piece of paper literally has more value than your actual life. Like if that doesn't bother someone, I don't know what does. That's how I look at it. Something that doesn't breathe, something that's just literally something you could just fucking rip up into fucking pieces. Something that could just get blown away in the fucking wind. Currently not too windy as I speak, but it is a little breezy. But anyway, you know, not seeing anything wrong with that. I don't know what you see, you know, like, I, I, I don't, I really, did, I don't know. It's like, it's crazy how many people are blind, you know, they don't see the whole picture. And then for us people that do see the whole picture, we're called the crazy ones, we're called the, the psychos or the slow ones or pff, slow, that's the least thing. But, uh, you know, that's what we're known for. I mean, well, we just see the goddamn truth. Something that's just common sense it really shouldn't even take a brain to fucking see what this bullshit of a fucking existence truly is. You know, it's just common motherfucking sense, you know. Excuse my language, but people get killed because of money. People do stupid tasks for money. People risk some kind of, uh, you know, life threatening situation for money. And the list could just keep going on. I don't feel like going on and on with it, but you get my point. You know, so that's what I pretty much mean. My life is all just a big waste of a scam. 
They say stay away from scams, but how can you stay away from a scam when this whole existence is a fucking scam? That's the real question. They say it's a blessing to be here. Want to know the real truth why they say it's a blessing to be here? Because they got another sucker in the world to fuel the economy. You know, you're just another sheep out there. You're another machine. You know, you're another, woo, 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 you know, like a motor, you know, you're another fucking motor with springs participating, fueling up the economy, making the elites rich, giving the government complete power. So that's when they say it's a blessing to be here. You have meaning here. Yeah. Meaning to be a sheep, do shit I may or may not want to do all my life. But just to make them elite bastards rich and wear out my body in the future, drained, complete headaches or whatever, you know. And in the long run, what reward am I truly going to get? A tombstone. Tombstone. You know, that, that's the real reward in the long run. But, you know, it's a blessing to be here in the meantime to go through all this bullshit. It's a true, you know... It's a true blessing. It's a true gift. You know, couldn't ask for anything better. <laughs> I mean, just come on. If you don't see how sarcastic that sounds, you know. Anyway, I'm going to wrap it there. Just a little rant. Uh, yeah. Stick around. Stick around. Love you all. Oh, and you can hear in the background a train passing by uh, probably taking the sheeps back home from their sheep duties. Peace out.